Welcome, my name is Stuart Gordon-Smith. I'm the Export Sales Engineer for Meach International. Today I'm going to talk about in-mould labelling, which is the technology for the decoration of plastic parts and containers during an injection moulding process. In this presentation I will be showing you two methods of label application using the Meach Hydra system. One system is for flat labels, the second for decorating the side walls of containers. In both cases, the positioning of the label is important, preventing the waste of material and resources. This diagram shows the effect of the electrostatic charge pinning the label on the mould tool, while the vacuum holds the label in position. Vacuum cups can be used, but can cause distortion in the label. A better method is to use vacuum channels cut into the mandrel face. The proximity of metal such as bolts or screws within the charging recess will affect the performance of the system, slowing or preventing the charging of labels. This video clip shows the process of pinning flat labels to an 8 cavity mould tool using Meech Hydras powered by one Meech 994 IML controller. This designer mandrel uses vacuum cups as a method of transferring labels from the label feeder to the mould tool. Behind each one of the eight labels is a single Meech Hydra pinning head. The number of pinning heads required will be determined by the surface area of the label. The following section looks at the application of labels to the side wall of the cavity. This produces decorated items such as containers and cups. The mandrel design is made up of an earth shield, preventing the charge from going to ground, a recess, housing the hydro pins below the front edge of the label, and the body of the mandrel with vacuum slots machined into the surface, allowing the label to self-wrap around the body of the mandrel. Where thicker material is being used, a mechanical method may be required to overcome the memory of the material. This designer mandrel will apply labels to the base as well as the side walls of the cavity. This mandrel is designed for a parallel walled container. It uses a mechanical method to press the front edge of the label into the recess at the bottom of the cavity. The third designer mandrel is for a tapered container, such as a cup, which is shown in operation during the following film clip. The side access robot collects the labels from the label magazine. The labels can be seen to self-wrap around the mandrel. A mechanical label collar can be seen closing around the label and mandrel. This is useful for label thicknesses above 120 micron. The label is inserted into the mould tool. When in position, the high voltage is activated, causing the label to expand and stick to the walls of the tool. As the mandrel retracts, the charge is applied to the whole surface of the label without the need for direct contact between the high voltage system and the label or the tool walls. Thank you for spending time with me today. I hope you found this video useful. If you would like to find out more regarding in-mold decoration, please contact Meech at sales at meech.com or visit the Meech website at www.meech.com.